Hi guys, this is Sadeh from Dwarven.com and in this video, we'll show you how to close all the apps from the recent app screen via ADB command. So re recently my phone started crashing and freezing and it was not working along the expected line. So I found out this nifty workaround using which you will not have to interact with the phone, but instead you may close all the apps from the re recent app screen simply using the ADB commands. And in this video, I'll show you how to do just that. But before that, do keep in mind that your phone should have enabled USB debugging beforehand. In my case, that, that was already the case. So I did not have to enable USB de debugging. If you haven't yet enabled debugging and if you are in a position to do so, then you may re refer to my guide and enable USB debugging. In short, you have to go to the settings system about phone and tap on build number seven times, then go to system developer option and enable the toggle next to USB debugging. Once that is done, let's now get started with the guide. So first of all, you'll have to extract the Android SDK platform tools. So get it from my guide and extract them onto your PC. You could extract them anywhere you want. In my case, I've done the extraction in C drive and these are the files of platform tools. Once that is done, you will now have to enable USB debugging as I've told you before. In my case, it was already enabled. So that was not a cause of concern. Moving on, now you will have to enable CMD inside platform tools folder. So type in CMD in the platform tools folder address bar and hit enter. And now type in ADB devices and re-verify that you are getting a serial ID. This signifies that the connection has been established successfully and we could now move ahead. So now comes the most interesting part of this guide. So first and foremost, type in the below command and it will take you to the recent app screen. So as you could see, we are now inside the recent app screen. And now you will have to type in this command and it will select the first app window. In my case, as you could see in the recent app screen, the first app window is from the settings app so it will select that app let me show you you could see a white border has covered the re settings app so you will have to keep on typing this command until this selection reaches the force close or clear all apps button in case of pixel it's at the extreme left so you have to keep on typing this command until it re reaches that stage so let me show you i'll have to do so once again and once again and with this clear all button has been selected in my case all the apps have been skipped and now we are in the clear all button once that app has been chosen all you have to do now is simply use this command and it will act as an enter key so simply type in this command paste here and it will hit enter and the clear all button will be executed and with this all the apps are now gone from the re recent app screen you may verify the same as well so let's bring back the recent app. As you could see, there are no app whatsoever. So guys, this was all from this guide. The only thing to keep in mind is that the USB debugging should be enabled beforehand. If you, if that is not the case, then this tweak might not work. On the other hand, if your phone is working well and good, then you may easily enable debugging now and then get this job done as well. So on that note, I round off this video. If you have any queries, do let me know in the comment section and thanks a lot for watching.